currently set the the close of session forecast in May and then uh, been locked in the the forecast for these two years uh, there there wasn't an assumption uh, like this of a of a tax bill in there so uh, should that be passed that would be additional revenue over and above what was forecast so all else equal we're starting to get into that sort of uh, territory does our state constitution allow us to by statute amend the kicker law and say we didn't foresee the federal government making a big tax change and ergo we shouldn't have to uh, I, know, I know a lot of this is constitutional but yes uh, representative knows they the only the the kicker calculation it, it just always remember it's two numbers it's the close of regular session and that language is in the Constitution close of regular session the estimate the base that they that uh, Mark and Josh gave you in September, that's the base compared to what actually comes in the door that we won't know until August of, of 19. Which so it's can, those two numbers. Didn't have the, somebody didn't have the foresight to know that that Donald there was going to be some, yeah, yeah, or, yeah exactly. Speak. So, so okay. there's, no, there's no allowance for that, so you make the calculation. The one thing you do have the, the power to do in the legislature is um, you can, um, with a two-thirds vote, you can, quote, change the estimate. So basically okay. what you would do, if you got the two-thirds vote, you would tell us, or tell LRO to calculate, put, give us a number to make sure that we are over the threshold or whatever number you want, and then, or with the number that <coughs> includes the federal estimates, and then you could, you could change the estimate on a one-time basis with a two-thirds <coughs> vote. Okay. That's the mechanism.